What's up guys, it's Scythe That and Tigra back again for another Zelda Ocarina of Time. Let's play this game together, baby. Yeah. So it's been a few days since I've been since I played this game. Ooh! Look how awesome this game is. He actually raises his right leg based on the grounding that he's on. Cool. This game's deep. But yeah, last episode we took care of the forest temple. Today we're going to be doing as much gathering and catching up on stuff as we can before I get bored with that and want to press onward. But I ended up coming back here to the Temple of Time because Zel- I mean, Sheik is all like, gonna teach us the Song of Time, I think. Hello? You have a very beautiful eyelash. You destroy- <clears throat> You destroyed the wicked creature that haunted the temple and awakened the sage. But there are still other sages who need your help. Yeah, I know. In order to awaken all the other sages, you must become, like, more powerful. You must travel over mountains, underwater, and even through time. I've, I've already traveled through time. If you want to return to your original time, return the Master Sword to the Pedestal of Time. Yes! We've been needing that. We have been needing that. By doing the <clears throat> By doing this, you will travel back in time seven years. Okay, cool. Whoa. The, t the, t <clears throat> the time will come when you will have to return here quickly. I will teach this to you for when that time comes. Okay, the song to return you to the Temple of Time, the Prelude of Light. What a beautiful name. Yeah, just pull that out of your butt. Whoa, too happy. Hey, this thing's glowing again. You have learned the prelude of light. Oh my god, it's talking to me. You didn't tell me this thing was alive. As long as you hold that l that arcana of time and the master sword, you hold time itself in your hands. But what about when I put it back? Shut up. Sconch, we shall meet again. You're going to do that thing again, right? <coughs> Oh, oh god that time there was light out of that thing that hurt my eyes we're gonna go back in time because oh baby have we been waiting for this drop and... ah! oh I'm young me again oh Ooh. Now I'm... Ah! All right, so we got gotta take that mask off so you guys can understand me instead of it being like, oh hey sir, I got, hey sir, I got this eye mask on and I, uh, you know, yeah, it's tough to do that because then I'm playing the game one-handed, right? But yeah, we got quite a few things to do now that we are finally childhood friends again. This place is beautiful, but why are we so light? Why were we so light that? What's going on with the character models? Maybe there's some weird graphics setting that changed, or has it been that long since we've been a child that things have changed? At eight, we're going over here because we have to climb up these vines and go over into the corner so that we can get the fire spell from the fairy. Apparently, I think this is the only required spell that you need from the fairies, but we're still gonna be going for all of them because they're awesome. <laughs> Isn't there a skull tool in here at night? I think there is. Yeah, but it's not nighttime right now anyway, so it doesn't really matter. I guess we could change it tonight, but we'll see. As I state almost all the time, hello, stupid sign. We're not really going for. Ugh. 
We don't have any bombs. Is there any is there any plants around? Is there anything around? All right. Well, you know what? Then we're going we're going to just go to Epona. After I check in here, I want to see if there's a Skulltula, but I don't think so. Anything in here? Hello? Oh. Okay. Let's just go to Epona's ranch then. Ugh. Oh. Well, that was weird. Are we supposed to be here at night? Hello? Malin's gone to sleep. Uh, I'm going to sleep now, too. Come back in the day. Okay. But you know what else we can do before we end up playing the Sun Song? Where is it? Where's that stupid Skulltula? I really shouldn't be using that thing, should I? Hiya! Hiya! Can we get it from here? I hope so. Ha! Ah! Oh, well, we got close. Are we locked on? There we go. Hiya! Come to daddy! You destroyed Skulltula! Alright. What's the, what's the day song? A down up? Oh, no, that's the... <laughs> That's the uh, rain song. We learned that one a little bit later. Where is, where's the day song? Serious song, sun song. Right down, up, right down, up. All right. Right down, up, right down, up. Oh, bum, 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 bum. Ooh. Is she over in the fields now? Yeah, because there's a Pona. So we gotta learn this song from her. Ah, oh, such a memorable song. All the soundtracks, all the musics, the musics in this game are so memorable. Hey, marry me. Oh, it's the fairy boy again. Yuck, I heard that you found my dad. How did you like the castle? Did you see the princess? He <laughs> he. Yeah. Dad came home in a hurry after you found him. He <laughs> he. Oh yeah, have he? Ha, I have to introduce you to my friend, Fairy Boy. What? Would you just call me Fairy Boy? She? Oh, okay. Uh, she's a horse. Her name's Epona. Isn't she cute? Do we? Do I do this? Teach me. Teach me. It seems like Epona. It seems like Epona is afraid of you, Fairy Boy. I know. Teach me. How do I do this? What do we do? I didn't actually look this up because I thought it was going to be easier. My mother composed this song. Isn't it nice? Let's sing together. Okay. Oops. I can't really sing, but I can play it. Oh, cute Arcrina. Is she to me? Is she like degrading us by saying that we're cute and stuff? Are you going to play this song with that Arcrina? Yeah, sure. Wow, that sounds terrible. That's totally MIDI. <laughs> uh, ooh! Hey! This isn't the Skrin or Krina, but... You learned Epona's song. Stop talking to me, you're a flute! With this power... I can do anything! What was that guy doing? Whoa! Um, I think I think she likes me a little too much. How do I get her to stop? Oh, Epona, she's grown fond of you, fairy boy. I, I know. That's that's the problem. I don't want. Oh, oh God! Oh, what have I done? Okay. I am. Ah, uh, we need bombs, man. We need bombs. I'm underprepared. I didn't go and stock up on stuff for this episode, so we're probably gonna be running around a lot. I don't need more rupees. Is she actually following us? Oh, that's just those mummy and daddy horses. Oh, can we please find bombs in here? Hiya! No bombs at all, huh? Okay, isn't there a chicken game in here? Or is that when we're an adult? Whoa, hey, wake up Mario. Ay, caramba! Uh, that's not Mario, but... Huh? I'm awake already? What? Well, I'll be... Uh, oh. I'll be, if it ain't the forest kid from the other day. <laughs> By the way, thanks a lot for waking me up. 
it took some doing, but I finally got Malin back in a good mood. So, what are you up to today? Got some free time on your hands, you say? Well, how about a little game, Scarecrow? These three cuckoos I have are special super cuckoos. I'm going to throw these cuckoos into that there gaggle of normal cuckoos. If you can pick it out, these three special birds from among the normal cuckoos within a time limit, I'll give you something good. Uh, okay. If you can't find them, I win. It'll be 10 rupees. Wanna play? No, not just yet. Because I wanna do the ultimate strategy. Hiya! This is a this is a decent strategy that you can do to make it a little bit easier on yourself. Is you just get all of these buggers, all the normal ones, into the corner of the room. Ha! Which, if he ends up throwing a super cuckoo into the corner, then we're definitely gonna be screwed, but well. Hopefully it's gonna work out, right? Ha! And you too! hey -ya! Is that it? Is that all of them? Alright, let's just do it anyway. Yes! You have 30 seconds! Alright, start looking! Ugh. See, like this is one? Let's one of them keep it up! Two more to find! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There's another! Is it one of these? It better be this one. Oh, yes! Golly, be d I'll be darned. It's a plum incredible. La that's the last one. You found all of them, boy. Come over here. Okay. What are you going to give me? It better not be a sock in the mouth because I've already gotten those gifts enough from the people, <laughs> the people that I used to work with. Hey, you! It, you got the talent to be one of the world's best cowboys. How would you like to marry Malin, huh? <laughs> no! Ha oh, ha! Oh, I was just kidding! Uh, just kidding. I think you're a little young for that, aren't you? Ha oh, ha oh, ha! Oh. I think he says that even if you say yes. Oh, I'm proud to present you uh, to a sample of our Lawn Lawn Milk. You'll be energized the moment you drink it. He <laughs> yuck! After you drink it, Gosh, you can bring this bottle back and buy and refill. Rah! You found the second bottle. Who cares about the milk? Yeah, if I wanted milk, I'd get it from my body. That's gross. All right. Please just give me bombs. No, bombs. These aren't bombs. Are those green bombs? Oh, God. I don't know where to go other than getting a Pona, and we've already spent like 12 minutes in this episode. Ooh! Something we could definitely- Oh, that's weird. Something we could definitely do is go and do this Dampy game. Yeah, this is another thing for a heart piece. Hey, kid. Don't mess around with the graves. I am Dampy the Grave Digger. My face may be scary, but I'm not a bad guy. Let me give you an advertisement for my side business. Okay. Dampy the Gravekeeper's heart pound engraved into her. What's gonna come out? What's gonna come out? When I start digging, we'll find out. Okay, you're scary. Do you want me to dig here? Ten rupees for one hole. Yes! Dig. Wait, we're not on... Nope, nothing here. Well, nothing can be here. You gotta be on this patch, you dummy. So, yeah. Whoops, I didn't mean to take a screenshot. We gotta get this guy on this stuff. Come on a little closer there, damps. Do you want me to dig? Yep. Okay, and it's completely random whether or not you end up getting the heart piece or not. And, nope, nothing there. And you want to dig in the soft patches twice? That's these things that I'm standing on right here. You want to dig on them twice, because there's a chance... Oh, it's too bad we didn't have any bugs to get the Skull Tula out of there, but... But yeah, unless there's some on this map, hopefully. But yeah, so I'm going to just keep doing this until we end up finding the heart piece. Uh, I'll do this last one on camera right here, but this is going to take a little while because of his slowness. Plus, having to do it twice each, I hope we have enough rupees. Do you want me to dig here? Yes. Please be the heart piece. That's not the heart piece. Yes, dig here. 
Oh god. This is gonna take a while. Yes! Dig here. Anything? Oh well it's good it's good money. Dig here, yes! No! Okay, dig here, damps. You you're not even on the right spot! Come on! Come on! One more step, stupid! There we go! Now dig! Oh, there's just nothing there. Alright, what about this spot? Dig! Oh. Dig again! Oh, screw you! I don't know what I've been told. Dampy's face is mighty old. Dig here, you freak! That's not a heart piece! Dig again! Ah! I don't know why the walkthrough said to dig twice in one spot, because I haven't ran into anything by digging a second time, but hopefully we'll be able to get the heart piece before we run out of money. Dig! Dig, 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 dig! Well, that's good money, at least. Dig again! Dig, 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 No, nothing here. Oh, my God. Seriously, come on, hurry up. Just because you got a weird face doesn't mean you gotta move like you got a weird body. Maybe he does. Hey, Hunchback of Notre Dame, dig here. Uh, okay. Is that it? Nope. Dig again, stupid. Yeah, I'm looking for a human heart, so maybe you can just dig and uh, find it for me? Nope, nothing here. Really? Okay. Please, just find it. Please tell me that's the heart piece. Dig again, you stupid. I don't know why it says to dig twice that walkthrough's full of crap! Dig, 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 dig again! What? I guess when it said that it's completely random, it must be legit really random because this is the last spot for him to dig. That, that's it. Like, after I tell him to dig once more? And it just goes in and every time we've dug a second time. That's it. We've already dug out this entire place now. I'm gonna try making him dig on this last spot, and then if that doesn't do it, then the walkthrough is a lie, and there is no heart piece at all, because I've made him dig on every spot. Otherwise, that means we'd have to come back here another night, which I am not going to do. Dig again in the same spot you already dug. Oh. Okay, so it does seem to be completely random then. Maybe that's what... Oh. Is that what it meant by making him dig... Ah. Two things. One, the game randomly froze on me, and I had to redo every single thing that we already did in this episode. And to clarify, because I don't quite remember, because it's been a long, it, it's it's been quite a while for me, because I had to redo everything. I don't know if I said this, but yeah, you got a piece of heart. You've collected three and need one more. Thank goodness. But yeah, so you don't get him to dig the same place twice. You get him to dig the same place twice per round so he digs this one once then he goes all the way around then you get him to redig it again as opposed to what i thought where it was like i was just redigging that same spot like two times in a row and it was ridiculous ha roll spin attack i said spin attack you know what screw the spin attack stop it is there gonna be oh i'm gonna prepare because if there's bugs under here, then that is perfect. Yes! Alright! Yeah! No, please let me go! Screw you, bugs! So this game seems to be pretty smart about, you know, giving you the right drops that you need that are right there for you. Now, as far as I know, we can do this. And then, if I swipe fast enough, yeah! You can re-grab your same bugs! No, please don't! Yeah! Hiya! And as far as I know, every single one of these plant things has a bug in it. So we got a lot of stuff to do. We got a lot of stuff to do. Seriously. Like bring a cuckoo up here and jump before this guy knocks us over. Rah! Get out of my hands, I'm going in here now. Heart piece! Rah! We got a fourth! Hey, we got our second row of hearts! That's awesome! I'm gonna yeah, figure out... I, I'm gonna yeah, wander around for a bit and try to figure out how to bring back this chick's... cuckoos. God, that sounds wrong. Okay, well, I don't know about the cuckoos. 
But there's this little guy. Uh-oh. Looks like we gotta climb up. Because, yeah, I was exploring quite a bit, and I know, I know that we have to get behind the shop. You got Skulltula stuff. We gotta get behind that house right there. And I don't know how, because there's a guy in there blocking it. Because we gotta get to the other side over there to get to that Arakaku. But I, I'm not exactly sure how to do that. Ugh. And I don't really feel like looking it up. At least not right now. So we're gonna go to our stuff. Like this. Planting a bomb and get ready. Find the hole. Yeah. Woo. We're in the Lost Woods. This was a place that we couldn't go to before. Ow. Oh, whoops. No. Hey, come on. Hey yeah, there we go. What's up? I surrender. To make your quest easier, I can enable you to pick up more Deku nuts. But it'll cost you 40 rupees. Not right now. Yikes, I'm going home then. Oh, I didn't expect him to leave. What's what's your story? All right, all right, you win. In return, I will send you Deku seeds. 30 pieces, 40 rupees they are. No. I want that other guy's deal. Where did he go? Bleh. Uh, reappear! Ah, that's better. You stay here and now. Yes! Yes! Thank you very much! Brah. Now you can carry many Deku nuts. Many? As opposed to not many? Oh! Don't suck me in the mouth like that! Uh, uh. There's a couple things that we gotta do in this forest! Doop, 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 doop! Rah! Like going this way. And then going this way. Because this seems like one of the most useless spots to go to. But it isn't. Because there's stuff we can do. Thank goodness we still got some seeds. We're gonna need to get some more as soon as we can afford it though. Hello little seedling. Grow. Meh, I'm free. Ah, yeah. Now I think there's supposed to be something over here. I can smell it with my nose. Yeah. Him. Hiya. What do you do, Buster? I surrender. To make your quest easier, I can enable you to pick up more Deku sticks. But it'll cost you 40 rupees. Alright, that sounds fair, even though I don't use many of them. Rah! You found a stick! I thought there was supposed to be... Ooh. Thanks for the hearts, Buster. I thought there was supposed to be some kind of Deku theater, but... Oh, maybe that... No, it's not when you're an adult. I don't know. How can anybody focus with such awesome music? Okay. Okay, I... Oh. Oh, wait a minute. You know what else we can do? Thank goodness I remembered. Hiya! We can do this! Bugs, go! Yeah, we're free! We're finally free! Not one of you. Ah, you're not free. No! Yes! Now give me Skulltilla Fever. What? Why didn't that do it? Oh, there we go. hey -ah! I said hi -ah! Yum, 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 yum. You got Skulltilla. Okay, okay. Now, like we said we were going to do at the beginning of this episode, because this is already dragging on pretty long. Pretty darn long, especially for me because of the stuff I had to do off camera. We're gonna go to the fire fairy now. Yeah! Oh. Well, before we go to the fire fairy, I guess we better get this guy, huh? Hey ya! That's what you get for hurting me. Uh, backflip! Huh? I said backflip. Backflip! Are we missing it? I think we're just missing it. Okay, I'm just gonna use the friggin' boomerang. I'm pretty sure you can just backflip into that one. I think there's another- Yeah! I think there's another Skulltula thing in here. In this area. On this map. But I don't quite remember. Wait, let's check our map. How does this work? How does this work? Oh, we got 30 Skulltulas at least, but... Yes! Come on! How do we zoom in and tell if there's... I don't know how we tell. 
Wait. We gotta go to the Zora's domain? Get! Okay, the joystick doesn't want to cooperate, so to heck with it. We're gonna go to that stupid fairy now. <laughs> Check. Dead end. Doesn't look like a dead end to me. Fire in the hole. What? What was the bomb like just an inch too short? Come on, fire in the hole. Yes, it was. Uh oh, it's a crawl space thing. Yep, tip, 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 tip. Oh. Great Fairy's Fountain. It's dark and scary in here. Hello? Do I gotta play Zelda song? Oh my god. I know that laugh anywhere. You're evil. Why is the camera so provocative? You're so pixelated and gross. Talk to me. Welcome, Skunch. I am the Great Fairy of Magic. Oh, you don't say. I will give you a magic spell. Please take it. All right. <laughs> Is it just red spit? I can spit red if I wanted to. I just have to punch myself in the gut. Rah! Now you can be the wizard too with Din's fireball. It fireballs and golf flames. <laughs> this position is very uncomfortable, but you can use Din not only to attack, but also to burn things. Oh! When battle has made you wary, please come back to see me. <laughs> hey! You know what that means? You know what that means we could probably use that on? I know what that means we could use it on. The infamous place where we, <laughs> where we first died. Oh God. Let's go back there before we call it. Ha ha. Revenge will be ours. We can finally go in here and we can set these things ablaze, my brothers. We can set it ablaze. This better actually be for something good. It better. <laughs> yeah! There was probably a lot easier way of doing this, but... Hello? Rah! Yeah! Bombs? It was all for bombs. Oh, God. Okay, well, you know what? We're gonna call it here for today's episode, guys and girls and everybody that's watching this, because uh, in tomorrow's episode, actually, wait a minute, check this out. We got 30 Skulltula, so in tomorrow's episode, we'll grab the Skulltula thing. Actually, I'll grab it now. I'll grab the 30 Skulltula thing right now, just before we end up calling it an episode. And in tomorrow's episode, we got a little bit more gathering to do before we can start questing. Gathering... Like, m things that we actually need, not just heart pieces and skull tulas and stuff. We're going to be getting a Pona, and then hopefully we're going to be able to do the big long trade quest of this game to get our hands on the giant Goron sword. And then we're going to tackle the fire dungeon, but we might not get to that in tomorrow's episode. We shall see. First, I want to go talk to this guy doing jack jackups. The curse has been broken. Thank you. Here's a reward for you. Rah! You got a giant's wallet you can carry even more gold. Oh my god, that's the best reward ever. We're gonna call it here. So, thanks so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like. And if you want to see more in this series, be sure to subscribe. Sayonara and stay epic. Your face.